he was doing like what, 100 before normal idea. Now you drop down to 70 with a band around your hip. The band around the hips creates so much force around your hip, so it's creating more tension around that hip drive. So it's making an RDL a much more of a complete movement that not just targets the hamstrings in the lengthen range, because you're adding tension to the shorten range as well. Yes, it's going to want to force you to do that because that's you not using your glutes and using your quads. So if anything, the banded RDL is going to force you to really think about and engage your glutes much more when you're going for the right movement pattern through a correct hip hinge, which again, no knee drive, full hip extension, and then full hip flexion. That's all you're thinking about. Nothing else exists. Forget about the bar, forget about anything else. All you're thinking about is literally driving the hips back so you reach full hip extension and then driving the hip, bar, hip forward. Now, the extra tension on the hip, it's gonna force your glutes to do more work and, and make the movement far more complete.